How many clicks does it take to complete the sheep shearer quest on a new account? So I was on YouTube and I found a YouTuber called D-Pad Gamer who made a lot of videos on how many jumps does it take to complete X game. Specifically I was watching the Banjo Toei one and I thought this was super interesting of a concept and I thought what can you do that is kind of similar to RuneScape because obviously you can't jump in RuneScape. So I thought how many clicks does it take to complete something specific? Now, of course, the first thing I thought of, which is this video, is the Sheep Shearer quest. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a new account, I'm going to complete the tutorial island, and from where I spawn out of the tutorial island is where my starting point is going to be. Now, when you leave Tutorial Island, you have 18 items in your inventory, and I do not feel like wasting 18 clicks on dropping all the items to have space for the balls of wool. So what I decided to do is use a couple of clicks to go to the bank and deposit everything with one click. One click used on the stairs, and another one, and then the keys on my keyboard to go up the second time. Then one third on the bank. Now on the bank, I had the tutorial, so I did have to waste another click, unfortunately clicking that away. I thought I would have to do it four times, but turns out I only had to click the X one time. That is the fourth click. Now the fifth click is going to be deposit everything into the bank. Now here's actually where I make the first mistake. I thought the shears cost more than one coin, so I clicked the all option instead of having to click multiple times to take out more coins. But it turns out I could have just clicked the coins once and that would have been fine. But the next mission after having the coins is to go all the way to the general store to buy the shears. And with that I actually decided to click on the furthest away stairs the second time to get as close to the store as possible. Hopefully saving a click or two. And I actually hoped that I could see the general store NPCs from here. But unfortunately even with the HD client... Which, by the way, does give an advantage because you have a further sight on your screen. I had to still click in the general store one time. Of course, the RuneLite plugins overall are really good for challenges like this. And I'm actually going to use the menu entry swapper here as well for buying the shears. Instead of having to right click the shears and then buy one, I actually just hold shift and click the shears one time. As you will see here in just a second, I have to click the vendors one time. And here instead of the value I just shift click and that is going to buy two shears which is fine because I only need 20 free spaces for the uh, wool. But finally we have everything and we can go ahead and shear 20 sheep which is all the wool we needed to be able to make all the balls of wool. Mostly I was scared of misclicking here and wasting a click, that would be very unfortunate, but uh, I did fine, I did not miss any of the clicks and this is of course 20 overall clicks for all the sheep done. And that is the last one I needed, and that took me of course 20 clicks, so let's go upstairs and with the HD client, with only one click, I can run all the way from the sheep pen all the way to the stairs up the castle to the spinning wheel and spin all the 20 pieces of wool. Now meanwhile I'm running here, I do want to say that after all of this is completed and I have my overall clicks, I'm going to show you guys how many clicks I could have done it with if I did everything perfect, so of course I will remove one click from the bank thing where I took out too many coins. And after that, I'm going to show you guys how fast you can complete the quest if you have help of another account. So that's going to be very interesting, but I did have to waste another click here on opening the door, which is kind of unfortunate. If it would have been open, then I could have kept one more click. And here we go. I did not actually have to click the baller wall. I could just click the space bar and that also saved me a click. So we're getting really close to done with the quest here. All I have to do is spin these 20 balls of wool, which of course requires no more clicks, and then go downstairs, go to Farmer Fred, which is very close to the sheep pen, have a talk with him, and that is going to be the end of the quest. And that is the last one we need to complete the quest. So now click on the stairs again to get as close to Farmer Fred as possible, and use the number two key to go downstairs. Now I wasn't able to click all the way to the farm, and I had to look as close as I could to the farm. And I feel like that is pretty much as good as you could get. I don't think I could really get there any faster. And now I had no more run speed. So I would have to enjoy some walking 
and uh, it is what it is but it doesn't really require any clicks so it's all good but we are getting really close to being done with the quest and so far i've used 20 clicks sharing all the sheep and then 18 clicks to do everything else all the walking buying the shears from the store going to the bank so yeah i think we're doing pretty good but i know that there are a couple of things that i was unfortunate with the door was not open for example at the spinning wheel also i did take out too much money by clicking on the all option i did not have to do that so at this point we could have been at 36 clicks but talking about closed doors and gates, especially coming up to Farmer Fred's house here, unfortunately both the gate and the door is closed and he is inside the house. So I have to use two more clicks to even get into the house here and that is now 39 clicks, 40 clicks for the door and the final click is actually going to be... 41 to talk to farmer fred and from that point i do not need to use any more clicks i can just use the keyboard and finish the quest so the answer is with my strategy 41 clicks is what you will end at and keep in mind that if the gates the doors and everything would be open and i would not have clicked on the all option i would have ended at 37 clicks so with my strategy 37 clicks is the least amount of clicks you could possibly get and keep in mind this is with the hd client if you're using the normal client i expect that to be quite a bit higher now going by the same restrictions, this is what it would look like if you have the help of another account. So the first click is to trade and of course my inventory is pretty full but I do have 10 spaces so I'm going to trade over 10 balls of wool. I feel like not dropping my items is definitely better because dropping 10 items using 10 clicks for that is definitely not that efficient. So only 3 clicks to get 10 balls of wool and then a 4th click to click to run all the way to Fred's farm. So when I'm at Fred's farm, I let my other account open both the gate and the door, so I have only one click to click on Fred the farmer to start a quest, and when I do this, it can only start a quest, I can't complete it in the same dialogue because I do not have 20 balls of wool, so I will have to use a couple of clicks here to complete the quest. So first you have to start the quest, talk to Fred the farmer, get it done, and then after that you have to talk to him one more time to hand in the 10 balls of wool, after this I will have to trade my main account again and get the next 10 balls of wool. The reason why I did it this way as I said is because dropping 10 items to get all the 20 balls of wool would definitely end up being more clicks than I get in this run so doing it in two trades is going to net me lower click amounts. But this is the last trade we have to do except all of these 10 balls of wool two times up at 8 clicks, 9 clicks and the last click on Fred the Farmer for 10 clicks overall to complete the quest and as I said this is with the same restrictions as before starting with all the items in my inventory and now only using a main account. So from my experience to complete the quest without any help you need 37 clicks for the least amount of clicks to complete the sheep shearer quest and if you have the help of a main account you can do it in 10 clicks. Now if you want to do this in the absolute least amount of clicks and you have really no restrictions so you can start wherever you want to, you can have whatever items in your inventory, whatever you want, you can do this in one click. You can just stand at Fred the Farmer, have 20 balls of wool in your inventory, talk to him and you're done. But come on, that would not really make that fun of a video and it's not really realistic. I mean, if you're a new player, you're going to spawn in the exact spawn point that I did and 37 clicks is all you actually need to complete the quest from that point. If you have a friend, you can get it in 10 clicks. That is what I wanted to see. I know this is not normally what I upload, but I thought it was a fun idea and I might start uploading a couple of videos that I just think are fun ideas on my channel now and then. If you did like it, please leave a like. If you have a better run idea, let me know that in the comment section as well. And until next time guys, take care.